Yes, well, we really are entering the final countdown now for the 2018 PyeongChang Winter Olympics. And preparations to welcome guests from all across the world are shifting into ultra high gear now. These efforts are ongoing not only at select areas, but also covers the nation's main gateway, Incheon International Airport, as well as the Olympic venues. Our Cha Sang Mi with this report. Incheon International Airport, the gateway to Korea, is busy preparing to host guests from around the world during the 2018 PyeongChang Winter Olympics. The PyeongChang 2018 mascots Suorang and Pandabi welcome visitors with traditional Korean performances. I think it's really exciting. I'm excited for the people who get to come and be here for the Olympics. There's going to be a lot more people coming in Korea. There is going to be a lot more uh, fun and parties and events. It's going to be great, I think, yeah. The airport is only the starting point. Welcome pillars have been set up at road junctions along the way to the Olympic venues. The snow-capped pillars serve as a lighthouse for those going to the Games. I'm so excited we are hosting the Winter Olympics and I feel honored that I could take a small part in the Olympic preparations. We are installing various sculptures like the welcome pillars along five different highways and at two train stations that lead to Olympic venues. We are also instructing business owners with the so-called good manner exercise. While Pyeongchang County is busy making sure it leaves a good first impression, a webtoon contest exhibition took place in Gangneung. Webtoon illustrators and cartoonists displayed the best of their talents with works related to the upcoming games. Some wanted to show their passion for the upcoming Olympics through their artistic skills. I drew the painting while thinking about the athletes who overcame their difficulties to prepare for the Games. I wanted to encourage the athletes. And some wanted to please visitors to the Games with a small gift of their portraits. I'm happy to participate in the Olympics preparations with my talent. And if you see this poster with Pawson, some traditional Korean socks, on buildings in Gangneung, feel free to drop in. Gangneung City has created a cultural exchange to make foreign guests feel more at home through the so-called welcome shop. As the name suggests, some 200 businesses such as cafes, restaurants and mobile phone dealerships offer free Wi-Fi, drinking water and restrooms for Gangneung's Olympic guests. And among them, there are shops where visitors have the chance to experience K-beauty and Korean aesthetic culture. In this welcome shop, as an additional service, makeup artists supply Korean makeup to visitors free of charge. I'm so glad I can contribute my talent as a makeup artist and be part of the Olympics. I'll be happy to present K-beauty to foreign visitors. Another Gangneung resident, an owner of a 25-year-old barber shop, says it is an honor for him that his hometown is hosting such a big sporting event. I would love to welcome guests from all over the world for the Olympics. I will make sure you get the best haircut when you visit. Residents and business owners at the Olympic host locations are looking forward to seeing their towns bustling with visitors from around the world. From Incheon Airport to shops and facilities in Pyeongchang and Gangneung, visitors can not only enjoy the Olympic atmosphere, but also experience the best of Korean culture. Cha Sang-mi, Arirang News, Gangneung.